Hey guys, Eclipse14 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Star. Alright, we did an optional thing that got ourselves a weapon from Yao, and now we're going to be heading towards what we need to do, which is find Dr. Luvino. So, with that said, what we need to do is simply head back to Cabinet. Number one, I can just go to Swallow to heal up, and number two, that's the way to go anyway, because we have to go to the Palm Spaceport. And that starts us off pretty well. Not a whole lot of Masetta, but any Masetta is good Masetta. Subsequently, we got a couple Scorpions to fight as well, and there we go. Hey, Noah leveled up and learned a new spell. Sweet stuff indeed. Let's, uh, let's actually see what he got this time around. Status, the uh, whoops. That's not who I want. Uh, no, I can't figure it out from status. That's a disappointment. Well, in any case, we're at Kamenite. Time to, uh, rest up and we're all good to go. Okay, so let's make our way to the Palma Spaceport and get through that manhole. Alright, so the manhole in question is all the way over here, in this southwest corner. Go down, and it's pitch black. Well, guess I'll use our flash again. Now this thing is... I didn't even move. <clears throat> this tunnel is literally the easiest path in the game. There is only one niche turn, and that's only necessary when we find Dr. Luvino, but I will go inside it anyway, because why not? This goes straight, and that's the turn I'm talking about. Inside here is this geek. Fine. See you later. Oh, green slimes. I can fight these guys. There we go, easy stuff. And then we go up the stairs, and now we enter the town of Gothic, which is literally across the river from the spaceport. Now none of these guys really will talk to you unless you give them a cola, which is kind of useless. But regardless of that, uh, there's just... Uh, there's this place, which is a second-hand shop, in which case you have the option of getting a flash transfer and magic lamp. Other than that, that's like really the only concern. With all that said, let's go ahead and just walk out of Gothic and find the doctor who is at Trotta Prison. some gold lenses to start us off on the western side of Palma. But, uh, yeah, I already know kind of just this route from playing before. Leveno is at the prison, and this area is... The enemies do get a little tougher, but it would be nice to fight them, because it gets nice Masetta and whatnot, and god damn these single step encounters. At least it's a single owl bear, which is a joke, but even still. Alright, so basically we're just gonna walk along this side until we reach this passage. Take a left in here, and there's the Trotta Prison. Walk through, and notice that you don't need a flash this time. Head straight. Do you have your road pass? Yes. And I can proceed inside this place. There are no encounters in this area, but you can walk around and just talk to people that are inside, and that's what I'm going to do, because why not? Use the dungeon key, since that key seems to use everything. Inside here, uh, nope. Cola is empty and I don't care. 
But yeah, that's what everybody in Gothic will say. Ask for a cola, and they'll talk to you. Which, uh... Tower Deep in Gothic Mountains is known as Medusa's Tower. Oh, okay. Well, Odin knows where to go now, but he's not going there just yet. Why? Oh, I don't know. I have no chance of surviving that place. Okay, a spider was talking to me. That's really weird, but uh, that's something of concern. Go over here for one final cell in the first row. Which, uh... Yes. Alright, interesting. At least he didn't ask for cola this time. But yeah, that's about it for that little area. But the main passage is to go to the second row. Which we need to use this dungeon key to get into. And this is the second half of the place. Which we have... This room. Let's go ahead and open it. See what he's got to say. Uh, nope. Oh, cool. Oh, that sucks. Hopefully we'll find it, because it's probably not going to be useless to us. Yikes. That's... that's not good. Granted, I've never seen a volcano erupt. Um... So, I wouldn't really know too well. Although, I have seen old lava flows. Oh! So, open that and. Uh, what a joke. Anyway, the passage to the right is actually the correct passage, but we'll go inside this place for one final thing before we talk to Lavena. Four skeletons. Which I will fight, because... why not? These are literally the only encounters apart from... the robot cop that's up front, which you can fight if you don't give him the road pass, but it's also a very tough enemy that you don't want to face right now. In this case, I actually am just going to cast a fire and be done with it. This takes out a couple enemies. It's still not doing anything. Whoops. Fire again! Alright, at least I finally got rid of some skeletons. Sheesh. At this point, I can just do normal attacking. And there goes one of them. Oh, I'm hitting start for whatever reason. Sorry about the, uh, pausing. I don't know why I was hitting start. But, ooh, there's a new spell. In this case, there's a hundred Masetta. Sweet stuff. Actually, what, uh, what do Dallas learn? Ooh, fire. Sweet. Okay, I'm kind of goofing up now. Anyway, this is the correct passage. In which case, I'm just going to uh, use this dungeon key one final time. And, uh, there he is. Walk back in. One more time should do it. Yep. And with that, uh, the doctor just gets up and leaves the prison. Well then. <laughs> 
Anyway, that's it for Toronto Prison. Yes, I still have the road pass. And with that, we can get out of the place. And that's it for the area. A couple of weird oddities that I made at the end. Oh, crap. This is tough. I could do it, but it's also probably an instant death. Um, cast fire. You know what, I am going to do it. So I'll just make sure I have fire castings. Yeah, that's the reasoning why I didn't want to do it. I guess I can cast fire again and just keep trying. I got the serpent! I'm not gonna do that again, though. You get 96 Masetta for that effort, but yeah, that was... That was oof. And Odin is at 4. I'm gonna go ahead and use Meow's Cure on him instead, and that'll work. Go ahead and head back up to Gothic. More owlbear is great. And now I'll take care of it. 24 more Masetta down. Oh, vampire. This I'm bailing. Even though there's one of them, I'm already at 12 minutes and I'm right there at the village. And, uh, yeah. Whoosh, that is a lot of Masetta. That's costly. Um, I'd rather just go back through the freaking, uh, tunnel. But anyway, go over here. And you'll find Dr. Luvano in this building. Oh, that's not the building. Maybe this building? There he is. And that's where we set the course for the next episode, because I gotta go back to the tunnel anyway. So, with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and close things here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.